What's up ladies and gentlemen, my name is Seth and today we're going to be taking a quick short look at the Trove to Trove Top Chaos Chest loot for this week. Why do these things fly like this? Like it looks awful. They look really good when you're just kind of roaming around on them because they flutter and flap around. They feel a lot heavier than they actually are, but either way, they look awful when they fly, don't they? So anyways, for this week we got Top Chaos Chest loot as a premium item which means that it is going to end up being more expensive than most. It's actually pretty cheap as far as a premium item is concerned. You can end up just crafting it if you want. The most expensive part is the 150,000 flux. The other resources, you can get these for super duper cheap, man. Like that's not even that big of a problem, but the flux is 150,000, so that's gonna be a problem and it depends how many chaos cores you have. Obviously you see I've got an overabundance, but other than that, if you don't have the resources, I would recommend that if you've been saving your chaos just to unbox them, Personally speaking, folks, I always recommend save all of your chaos chests until there is a premium item added to the chaos chest because then that premium item is going to end up giving you uh, a chance anyways of actually getting more chaos cores because the more of the premium item that you end up unboxing means that you can end up loot collecting it for even more chaos cores and having more chaos cores is pretty much all you can really do with chaos chests in this day and age because it's not like you're doing it for anything else right but uh anyways i think that's gonna do it so thanks for watching very much appreciate it. sign on and stay epic <laughs>